DU3. In this tutorial I'm going to talk you through the USB driver uninstall utility that's available on our website. If we go to the main website www.mapecu.com or www.mapecu.co.nz just go to the download section and then select MapCal when um, MapCal comes up. Under MapCal you'll find a USB drivers install for Windows section. There are three links. The first is a zip file containing all the USB drivers for the Map ECU 3. These are the ones you should redirect your laptop to use when you install the drivers for the first time as they're configured to optimize the Map ECU 3 and the, the latest versions. So when you disconnect your laptop from the internet as per the instructions you point it to the location of where you unzip the drivers and the install will proceed normally. Now if you do have problems and the other two videos don't help you, uh, you can sometimes solve the issue using the uninstall utility. These are provided by the chip manufacturer and we've created links on our website. The first one uh, the, is the uninstall utility which is a program, a Windows program. The second, the third one on the list is the driver and uninstall instructions from the FTDI website. If I click on that, you'll see some instructions, which is essentially what I'm going to take you through in this video. So I'll go back to the web, our website, and I'll click the uninstall utility. Windows asks me if it's safe to run. I say yes. This will then pop a dialog box. Um, so I currently have a Map ECU 3 plugged into the USB port and the drivers are installed. So the first thing you need to do is um, add the driver that you want to uninstall. The vendor and product IDs are defaulted, you shouldn't change those. But if you try and remove devices now without adding one, it'll come up with a message to say you need to add the device. So click OK, click Add, and that adds that vendor ID and product ID to the list. Then you click remove devices, searches for the devices and removes them. Simple as that. So if we try that again, click the device, remove devices, now it's confirmed that they are in fact removed. Um, so that's it. That's as, uh, as easy as it is. And now the next stage will be to go through a normal um, Map ECU 3 U a USB driver install as per the other video. Uh, it's as if your computer has never had a Map ECU 3 plugged in before and it'll run from scratch. So as per the other videos, download the USB driver zip file, unzip them or preferably use the CD-ROM that came with the unit and disconnect your computer from the internet so it's forced to look for the drivers and you want to use the ones from the CD-ROM or from the uh, zip file. Thank you.